Welcome back in another video. And as you can see, Bitcoin hit new all time high this month, 65,000. Ordinals also are performing incredibly well. Ordinals Max hit one Bitcoin, which is the first bigger size collection to hit one Bitcoin. Node Monkeys are also very close to do that as well. 0.9 at this current moment. And if you look at the Fear and Greed Index, you can see now we are in the Extreme Greed. So if you made a ton of money, probably this is a smart idea to take some profit off the table. Of course, not enough financial advice, guys. But in today's video, let's focus on some airdrop news. So one of these airdrop news we've got from Leonidas, and we know that Runestone is very close. So Runestone is basically the airdrop. If you use basically ordinals one year ago, you probably accumulated a ton of different ordinals in your wallet. So based on that, if you have at least three different inscriptions, you are going to be getting this runestone which is going to probably have something to do with the token when they're gonna launch on rune but runestone is already tradable otc on a whales market you can see a lot of people sold that already for almost 900 and this collection is going to be over 100,000 pieces and we might speculate that the floor will drop when this is going to be live on magic Eden, for example but despite the fact that this is the free airdrop people made a ton of money because if you qualify on a couple different wallets which i think it was highly possible because if you've been in this space for a while now that you have at least two wallets that you will qualify for if you want to check your eligibility you can just paste your wallet in here and you will see whether you're eligible or not we don't know when this is going to happen, and I hope this runestone is going to happen this week. Another news we've got from Parcel, which they recently announced an airdrop, and recently they changed their points. So now if you provide liquidity, you're going to be getting 5 points per dollar. If you have your position in your trading account, you're going to be getting 2.5 points per $1. Also, you're going to be referred to friends is going to be still the same amount, which is 10% of your friends' points. And also we've got something new like liquidations. So you're going to be getting 50,000 points for liquidation. So I'm not too sure how you can use that. Basically, if you can set up like a small amount to get liquidated, I think that's how I understand that. Maybe if you're going to lose this money, you're going to be getting 50,000 points, which is sort of like the reward you to get liquidated. I don't know if I understand that correctly, but that's basically the new criteria that they added. So the more you're going to accumulate points at the end, the airdrop is going to be in April. So the more points you're going to get, the higher you're going to rank, the bigger your token allocation you're going to get, and the more you can earn from that. Another news we've got from Tyco, and they raised 37 million. So this is the free test net. And if you're not grinding it yet, definitely do so because it's a really great opportunity for people with a smaller portfolio. And we know that test nets are massively overfound, but if you have a free time and you don't have a lot of capital to spend on airdrops, Tyco is definitely one of the airdrops that you want to grind. They have a lot of different campaigns on Galaxy, so definitely go there and start participating. Another one we've got from Ikubo, and they recently started distributing the rewards based on your liquidity pool deposited to Ikubo. So I earned 0.5 Starknet, so definitely not worth to providing liquidity if you're looking to get rewards from that. But if you want to qualify for the main Ikubo airdrop, it's probably worth to keep some liquidity going, because when they're going to drop it, I think it will be worth it. So another one we've got from Nostra as well. So you can see this is the update, how much points I accumulated based on my previous videos. And I, I showed you how you can guys do that. On the top of that, you're going to be getting the Stark rewards pretty much similarly as to Ikubo. And also when Nostra gonna airdrop the token is going to be definitely worth it in my opinion. Another one we've got from Lania where they added another quest so you can do only this one today. And tomorrow they're gonna unlock the week number three. And last but not least we've got airdrop from Shuffle which is the platform for crypto betting. And right now you can go to the website and you can check your allocation whether you qualified or not. So that's pretty much it. If you enjoyed this short update you know what to do. Hit the thumbs up, follow me on Twitter and I'll see you in the next one.